I just need a girl who gon' really understand I just need a girl who gon' really understand Good morning Ignore the fact that I'm crusty and dusty and ignore the fan too um, It's really hot in this room at night so we always keep the fan on and the window open Oh my god, I look crusty as fuck But I have an ultrasound today and we get to find out the gender but I don't think, I think we're going to make her write it down on a piece of paper. And then we're going to do a gender reveal. But yeah, technically we find out the gender today, but we're not actually going to know. It's just going to be on a piece of paper. So yeah, let's get ready. I'm going to eat an English muffin and probably have some cranberry juice. I'm really thirsty. And then after that, the only thing I can drink is water. And I have to drink about a liter, but she said I don't have to drink that much because I'm only 4'10 and like 100 and I think I'm 114 pounds now because I'm pregnant. But yeah, so I am 19 weeks now and in four days, three days, I will be 20 weeks. So yeah. Whew. By the time Christmas rolls around, I'll be 20. Three weeks, 22 weeks. Wow, this, the time's just going by so fast. But yeah, um, let's go get ready because this ain't it. Oh, do you like my Santa hat? Sorry about the fan again. I know it's probably annoying and sorry about the marker on the wall. The kids did that. Ren and sisters, but um quick little update before I show you pictures. Honestly, I had the worst experience ever. Um my last two ultrasounds were really good, really um chill. Um they were good experiences. This one I had a different person unfortunately. And honestly, I'm just so exhausted and hungry and I just really want to take a nap, but I'm going to give you guys the update. Um, we actually got to see, like, the person um, was able to show us the gender, but uh, we, Brennan and I wanted to not know. Um, we asked her to write it down on a piece of paper, but she said she couldn't do that. Um, so we have to go back tomorrow, which today is December 6th, by the way. I don't know if I told you guys that. It's December 6th, and today is when I had my ultrasound. Tomorrow I have to go back to pick up this little package, which shows the gender and tells me what the gender is. But we're going to do a gender reveal, so you guys won't know, and I probably won't know, and Brandon won't know. But we're gonna hand it off to somebody so they can do the major parts of like the gender reveal and like you know the balloon and stuff so me and brennan won't know either until the actual date of the gender reveal and you guys won't know until that video comes out so it's pretty scary but exciting at the same time but today i'm just going to be taking a nap and rejuvenating because after that experience the lady was just aggressive uh she didn't want to be there clearly and it was just not a good experience overall and i'm just exhausted so i'm gonna go take a nap and then i don't know if i'm gonna update you guys again today or maybe tomorrow but i'm gonna show you guys some pictures but yeah i'm gonna go eat and take a nap Okay, so excuse my hair and my face. I literally swear I was like shit in every video. But we just moved into a new room and I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. Mm -hmm. 
literally ignore the mess we just moved everything in here but the baby stuff we have one tv in here now and the bed and the cat um this isn't what it's gonna look like after this is just us throwing all the stuff in the room and then organizing it but this room is definitely bigger and brighter so yeah this is what we've been up to i think chloe likes this room better but yeah, so this is going to be mine and Brandon's room and the baby's room. And then Brandon has an office as well. So it is the next morning. Actually, it's not morning at all. It's actually 4 p.m. But it's the next day. And I'm just going to show you guys our little progress. Um, it's not much. We can't really do anything until Brandon builds the storage thing right there. But I'm going to show you what we did do. It's not much. Okay, so we actually put the sheets on the bed. The cat's just sleeping right there, so I haven't made the bed yet. But it's, as you can see, it's clearly 4.30 p.m. Um, so Brendan just has to build that storage thing. And then we can put um, this bin, organize it obviously, and then put it in there. And then we have a couple bins over there. We also have to figure out where we're putting this baby clothes thing. Ignore the, the soup bowl I just ate. We're going to move these somewhere. Don't know where. We also have to move the litter box not there because we want to put the bassinet there. I actually vacuumed the bassinet out, but then Chloe decided to sleep in it, which is my cat if you don't know. Um, there's also some sheets in there that we have to or sorry, uh, pillowcases and stuff we have to put on the pillows. And then I have to clean the bottom of that shelf right there. And then I'm going to put this bin and this bin on there. Um, but yeah, so that's basically all we have to do. This door doesn't go on there anymore. For some reason, I think it's broken. But I don't know if they're going to try and fix it or not. And by them, I mean Brandon. Um, I also want to put some lights, like I might put them there or there, um, we have our little, um, scented thing there, so the room smells really good, and it's also really nice when you turn on the, off the light, but yeah, so there's really not much to do, I'm going to do a room tour when we get everything together, I still have to build the bassinet because there's more to it but um i definitely like this room better it's definitely more open there's less tvs because brandon um took over the other room as his office instead uh, yeah i definitely like this room better it has more space it's more, it's brighter um it's it's gonna be better for the baby which is my main concern and i can definitely record in here better but the thing is with this room is the walls are really thin and I live with other people so I have to keep the fan on like 24 7 so they don't hear everything I say because if I'm doing a video or something it'll be like a little awkward I guess so I keep the fan on but um yeah I'll show you guys in another video probably be a room tour like I said in a different video and I'll show you guys what I do with the room but for now we're just rusting from moving everything in here and organizing and stuff and we're just going to get the room together as much as we can i have a busy week next week today is today is saturday december 18th and i have a busy week on starting monday i have a doctor's appointment monday i have a doctor's appointment tuesday and i have to go i'm going out with somebody on Wednesday I think and then Thursday is a break and then it's Christmas for um, my siblings so I'm gonna go visit them and have Christmas with them on Friday so I'm literally stacked I'm probably gonna film a week in my life that week so literally Monday um, so the weekend is the only time I really have to like do anything or less so that's what I'm gonna be doing so last thing i want to say before i end this video um i did get pictures from my ultrasound i know 
in my other two ultrasound I think I made two ultrasound videos I'm not sure but I actually showed you guys the pictures in the from the ultrasound I don't want to show you guys these pictures because the lady did a really shit job um, at like you know giving us good pictures so you won't be able to see anything like it just looks like blobs so I'm not going to show you the pictures me and Brandon do know the gender because we actually did look I know we weren't, we said we weren't going to look, but we did. Um, so me and Brandon know the gender, but you guys won't until the gender reveal. But hopefully that's soon so I can actually tell people and talk about it. But yeah, hopefully that's soon. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.